it will be morning soon, and no dreamer strong enough to bring the spring time back to our lands would ever dare fuck no dreamer strong strong enough to deliver the warmth to its home would ever dare discover something so vital yet so overlooked what who's there I'm armed. <laughs> Foolish thing. Where are you? Show yourself. I'm right behind you. No. Olympia? Exactly as you wrote me. But you're not... Not real. Have a seat. I've come to say goodbye, dear. Goodbye? Yes. I'm afraid you're dying. I... I can't die. Not while my manuscript remains unfinished. And yet here you are, freezing. <laughs> Look at your hands. Nonsense. I'll simply stoke the fire and then return to work. The one that went out hours ago? The one you watched die? I, I was busy. With your manuscript? Give that back! We are only now approaching the end. The woman with starboard eyes. No, oh, that's me. Give that back. The woman with starboard eyes recounted this to her companion as they stepped foot light across the dewy grass. <laughs> what pointless prose. It's not finished. And it never will be. Why are you here? To taunt me in my final hours? Taunt? No, I'm here to torture. After all that I've done for you? <laughs> oh, I've bled for you. I've pulled the supple fruit of poetry from my own stomach, spilled its messy contents across your endless pages. No, you have written because of me. But at least I've written for half a decade now. Is that not enough? Fine. Let's see it then. No. Don't read that. Fifteenth soliloquy, written and rewritten over thirty times. Was the twenty-ninth not enough? Give me that. And what's this? <laughs> the three hundredth page. Not even halfway through, I see. You're putting them out of order! Oh, look. Here we have the climax of the first arc. It was meant to be the true ending of the piece, but you were still unsatisfied. That's just how writing is. It's not writing. It's obsession. Ugh. My hands. They're too cold. I can't pick these up. Good. It made even less sense when it was put together. I need to light the fire. I need matches. And what will you use to keep it going? You never gathered firewood. Too busy debating the proper placement of a comma. Here they are. Thank God. All you have are embers. That will never last. The shirt off of my back, then. Only one match left, Hoffman. What a shame. Years of work, yet the manuscript dies with you. The manuscript! What? N no you can't do that. What? Afraid you'll burn too? I was going to live forever in those pages. Far longer than you. <laughs> so the muse does depend on the writer. Isn't that funny? No more. Don't you dare! You've bled for me before, haven't you? Maybe it'll put out the fire. Damn you, Hoffman! Damn you! It will be morning soon, and no dreamer strong enough to deliver the warmth to its home would ever dare to overlook something so vital. Yes, that'll make a fine star to a new novel, won't it? <laughs>